Our history with AVID is, goes back decades. Uh, we've seen AVID become the common currency. It is the language of audio, especially in Southern California and post-production. It is rare to find a facility that is not AVID-centric, whether it be Pro Tools and Pro Tools S6. Our relationship with AVID goes pretty deep and back numbers of generations. Uh, we've enjoyed uh, an understanding with them that is based on the concept that we have expectations of manufacturers to support our clients at the highest level. And that is the expectation we have with all our manufacturers. And Avid understands that, and we've been pretty successful along those lines. Uh, the S6 is a natural development of work surfaces. And when you have a high track count, you know, 2,000 tracks does not make any sense for a 2,000 input console. The complexity can be managed much better. So the S6 being the natural extension of that evolution uh, after a number of earlier Avid products, it is what people can use and want to use. It makes a lot of sense to stay within the same workstation you do your sound design in, do your music recording in, and the representation onto the desk is, is meant to be as tactile as possible because in the end this is still an art form and the people that mix are artists as well. Secondary rooms uh, for projects especially often would like to see a, a smaller work surface involved. That information, again, relates back to the Pro Tool session, which then comes out and is exploded on an S6, is quite advantageous. Uh, the MTRX component to these systems is critical. It is the central routing scheme that allows all these different various components, systems, objects, etc., to come into play, whether it be a playback system, a record system, mon a monitoring system, by extension from that, a, a very elaborate Atmos system. The MTRX at, at its core is a 1500 square router. Um, it's very well thought of. The sound quality of the, of the converters are, s are such an improvement over the what was the industry standard and in, in not that many years back that it really is a, the staple and the foundation upon which a lot of these systems are built. And as they add more and more capability to that system, it, it just gets more and more efficient. When a tool is the uniform tool throughout an industry, the manufacturer has responsibilities not only to uh, sustain and support product, but looking at the industry as a whole and, and getting good feedback to develop products that actually solve problems.